Mr. Alligator, I'm not sure how much help you'll be in this situation, but I guess you're better than nothing. What the? Zack, I don't even need to say it, do I? This is right out of that movie. Videodrome, 1982, directed by David Cronenberg. At the time, it was seen as a hard movie to digest for normal moviegoers, but now it's become a cult classic. I always just saw it as another weird Canadian movie, but this changes everything. My arm and my gun have become one. Now I can really understand what Max was going through. Okay. Oh, gosh. Oh, no, that's the wrong button, isn't it? Okay. Got like 27 minutes. They just appear wherever I am, don't they? Oh, they're so quick. They're so quick. Oh, my goodness me. Oh. locking on. I've, I'm using normal shells now. Did I run out of psycho-ness? Oh, I do do damage to them with normal bullets, it seems. <gasps> Son of a bitch! Oh my gosh, what if I just run for 15 minutes? Oh, I get money for unlocking those. Ah! I'm such a baby. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Who are they? Why are they, the, why are they horrible things with shears? Why do they want to snip snip me? What did I ever do? <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. <gasps> Why have I not got the psycho thing anymore? Did it have genuine ammo? And if so, how do you... No. No. Come on. Motherfucker. Oh, please. Some... Oh, I've got some first aid kits. Uh, yes, please. Oh, I didn't even. I didn't even. That did not do as much as I wanted it to. Two minutes. Two minutes. Lovely, stupid music is back. That was a nightmare. That was horrendous, right? Cup of coffee? Why are the nightmare fragment things, red shadow dudes dropping cups of coffee? Is that how they're trying to entice me in? She was found under the bridge, right? Here we go. I need, I need, I need a bit of time to recover. <laughs> this Please? is how it has to be. Who's that? Well, the murderer, I suppose. Why did the perpetrator decide to enshrine Lisa's body here? I don't know. That's what we're trying to find out, isn't it? There's a tiny Stonehenge there. Hmm. Remember this, Zack? What are you doing? What's he doing? Stone skipping. 
We did it all the time when we were kids. For some reason, I could never beat you. But I feel like I've got what it takes to win now. What do you say? Shall we take a trip down memory lane? I mean, should we? Do we have more pressing responsibilities? Stone skipping. Each stone has its own unique properties. Is cool better than good? Is that good? I don't know what this means. Oh, I see. Oh, we got a lollipop and some sunscreen. And a root beer. Capitano fragment. Okay, that's what we were getting for the shadows anyway. That was very unusual. Not bad, Zach. That was just as fun as when we were kids. Hey, what's that? Anywho. No wonder Ooh. the word Mississippi means father of waters. It has the power to carry boats down the tiniest of tributaries. It's one of the prime symbols of America's majesty and the vitality of the human race. More importantly, that's the, the now, family's that boat. boat. What sort of cargo would give it such a deep draft? What else do you see, Zack? I saw it clearly, if only for a second. The Dragonfly Crest. Yeah. This town never wants to stop reminding us about the Clarksons. Okay. We can do more stone skipping if we want to. Yeah, sure, you use a shreve pool. Oh, that was real bad. That was that was real bad. Yeah, let's use a Lafayette. Still not brilliant. Better than the previous one though. Okay, let's stop doing this now, because I, I don't understand what we're doing. Let's investigate the site, shall we? Maybe? Seems like a good idea. Hey, Zach. Do you remember the oracle? When the sun awakens, catch the tip of the baby bear's Why tail does he, does at the false altar. Why does he have to do the accent? And the entrance to the other world will reveal itself to you. I don't know if I want to go to the other world. In other words, we need to go to where Lise was found and look north at dawn. I wonder what we'll see. Is it that skull in the water? <laughs> it's a skull, Zack. As clear as day. It is pretty clear. That's the spot. The barrier between our world and the other world. One might call it a singularity. Would they? Why would they call it that? Now, what do you say we go inspect that cabin? Why did you leave me behind? You're not supposed to investigate without me. It was like 5 a.m. and there were shadow monsters. Oh, I'm s you just missed a special moment. What moment? The sugarcane plantation? So what? Ooh, the rice is there. You can't see it? All I see is the Clarkson's plantation and that gross silo. There you have it, Zack. Patty, Zack and I will take it from here. In the meantime, you need to head home and wait for us. You can't come to the other world, Patty. Wait at home? Alone? Yes, but only for a while. Once I make some progress, I'll contact you again. Hey, hold on! Don't also, you have school to go to? Also, would you mind telling Melvin that I'm heading to the sugarcane plantation? I'm sure we'll need his help later. Whoa, Agent York! Wait! You're really gonna leave a little girl like me here all alone? Act like an adult for once in your life! I promised to protect you from all the evil in our world. She came here on her own. You promised! Protect me! You'll be fine. You made it this far alone, didn't you? Exactly. Okay. Oh, I don't know if I want to do this. <laughs> Are we going off to the, um... 
the sugarcane plantation? Was the skull pointing? Because I thought that, I mean, the skull was in the water, right? It's very confusing. I've calmed down a little bit now, though. Okay, apparently I can't shoot down whatever that is, as much as I really want to. What's this? Crawfish tail. Can I definitely not shoot this down? I can! UFO bonus. What do you mean UFO bonus? Why was there a tiny UFO? <laughs> Look, Zack. We're about to encounter a new character. Oh, damn it. I know I saw her go inside. But it's empty. Oh, it's a clock. What's going on here? Hello, Danny. You won't be able to find the other world. <laughs> Who in the hell are you? What Maybe are you not, doing on our plantation? Not the best I'd like to ask you the same. Well, I'm. Hey, shut up. This ain't got nothing to do with you. I see. Well, if you don't want to tell me, then I have no choice but to guess. You just said this is our plantation. I assume that means you're a member of the Clarkson family. And you're here looking for someone. If there's a search being conducted on Clarkson property, it must Galena? be a search for Galena Clarkson, who's gone missing. Judging from the way you speak, your age, and most of all the color of your eyes, you must be Danny Clarkson, the father of the victim, Galena's husband, and the manager of the cold storage warehouse. Nice to meet you. I'm FBI Special Agent Francis York Morgan. I'm here investigating the Lee Clarkson case. Oh, and just call me York. That's what everyone's always called me. <laughs> you think I give a shit? You better watch your mouth or I'm liable to whoop your goddamn ass. I'm trying to help solve your dead daughter's murder. Your daughter was taken from you and now your wife has gone missing. No words can describe what you're going through. I imagine you're doing everything you can, searching every last nook and cranny all over town. But Danny, listen to me. It won't get you anywhere. No matter how hard you search, you'll never find them. What the fuck is with you? You want to throw down with a Clarkson? Absolutely not. I simply wish to solve this case. Then hurry up and investigate, goddammit! I am. That's why I'm here. The Oracle told me there's something in this spot. Oracle? That's right. Zack and I are following oracles given to us by a skeletal gentleman. Oh my god. If you wish to find the person who killed your daughter, you should cooperate. I imagine that not even the Clarksons want to start a feud with a federal power. I've had enough of your bullshit. Uh, Why's everyone and their mother been pissing in my ear today, huh? Shit! Does this mean you're ready to cooperate? May I enter the building? Do whatever you want. If you think you can mess with the Clarksons, you got another thing coming. <laughs> Trying to help you, salty bitch. Zack, it appears that the Clarksons have no idea where Galena is either. And judging from Danny's demeanor, the family must be in the midst of their own complications. This case may require more work than we think. Zack, Danny married into this family, didn't he? Yet he's acting like he's a full-blooded Clarkson. I'm surprised, really. That was the most unexpected aspect of our encounter. After all, he's only the son-in-law. What do you think, Zack? I don't know, man. I think he was kind of a rude asshole. Who's that? Have a quick look in the trash. Oh, it's a medium quality plate. Hello. Nope, nothing. Who's this? That's a very A pose like stance you've got there, my friend. Come back here. Let's go a little bit down here. Yank. Any rice. Sugar cane leaf. Chicory steam. 
Louisiana. Oh, stem. Oh, I'm hungry again. Flipping it, we're always hungry. Alright, in we go. 